Mickey, first things first, what does this place mean to you? This place is incredible. As a, as a young child, growing up watching snooker on the television, this is the ultimate place to be. Being a fan of snooker for the whole of my life, to see some of the professionals, it's like you're in awe of this. I've uh, just recently been promoted to, to be on the World Disability Billion Snooker Board, which is a great opportunity for me to represent the players. As a player as well, um, I've been trusted by the guys, they've recognised my potential to, to progress the sport, which for me is incredible and I uh, hope that I can uh, achieve some great things in this. In terms of Disability Day, what's the purpose of that? It's, to, it's basically to showcase snooker from a disabled person's point of view. It basically shows people that it doesn't matter what your disability is, doesn't matter what your level of ability is, come down and enjoy yourself and come and get involved because who knows, I did exactly the same thing, I knew nothing of it. I turned up to my local event, two days later I won the event and now I'm still at the Crucible Theatre. It just shows you anything is possible, get involved, please come and see us. Is it something that people of any disability can do? Absolutely, yeah. So we have different group ca uh, categorisations for different disabilities. So you'll come along, you'll get put into a category of people with a similar disability, and then you'll play against those people. So you can be an amputee like myself, or you could have learning difficulties. You wouldn't necessarily play against someone with the same disability, but you will meet some really amazing people, and you will be able to have the, the potential to come and play at the home of Snooker at the Crucible. I know that you're an amputee player, if you don't mind me asking, how did that come to be? So when I was a young child, I had a, a blood disease um, called talipes, which is uh, a clotting of the blood. My parents had a, a real tough decision on, on what the best outcome would be. They decided to go with the amputation. And football, you play for England, and you scored one or two goals in your time. I've been fortunate to, to play football for the England Amputee Football Association, which um, has been running for a number of years now. Um, I've been playing for near on 16 years. Um, England's all-time top goal scorer, voted World Player of the Year a couple of times, which is up there with another amazing achievement that I've got. European final. European final in front of 46,000 fans that were shit ass against Turkey a couple of years back. What accolade are you most proud of? Um, definitely playing here at the Crucible, 100%. We was given the opportunity to come and play here during the disability tour to showcase disability snooker at the Crucible, to play on a one table venue um, set up on TV is incredible and I won a frame, so uh, it's, that, that is definitely my biggest achievement.